how do you even approach building an application? Uh, you know, building your first um, your first report or your first form. How do you how do you do that? Well, Apex is declarative, and what that means is that you don't have to write a lot of code. Now, I'm not saying you don't have to write code. Period. Um, there are many applications uh, that have plenty of code in them, but uh, if you don't want to write code, you don't have to. Um, and you're going to basically declaratively say, I would like to create a new application. So you'll click a button and walk through a wizard for that. Then you'd say, I would like to create a new page. And on this page, I would like a report, right? And so it's very declarative. Uh, and there are lots of properties and, and ways to configure how your application and pages behave. Um, and and really, one of the major advances that came in this last release in Apex 5 is that they've introduced this component, which is called the designer view. And, with, and one of the gripes uh, that developers had with Apex um, up until this last version was that you had to click a lot. They said, yeah, it's declarative, but I feel like I just have to move around and, and click too much. It's not, uh, the process hasn't been streamlined enough. Uh, and that's where the designer view really kicks in. So uh, with Apex 5, you now have this view that looks like a typical uh, IDE, if you will. Uh, so if you've used something like uh, Eclipse or Visual Studio um, or any of uh, kind of the major um, integrated development environments, uh, you'll find that the designer view is very similar feeling to that. And the idea here is that you can do a lot with little or no code. And I also just want to, before I, I, I leave this slide, I just want to emphasize that um, if you have a requirement or if you have something that um, cannot be met by one of the declarative components in Apex, um, you can, I just want to say that there are many plugins that exist that you can enhance Apex with, as well as um, Apex also gives you the opportunity to just do your own thing. So if you just want to throw all the declarative components to the side and just kind of write your application as you would uh, if you were using something like Java or PHP, um, you can do that. 